everyone, we are here at EGX in London. Uh, we are queuing up to play Sonic Frontiers. So it's the first time it's been available to play in the UK. So let's get our hands on it and find out what we think. We've just played Sonic Frontiers for the first time and first impressions are really positive actually. So basically lots of fast action as you'd expect from Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, the open world section, although it was only limited in the demo that we got to play, was quite good fun to actually traverse. Going through a portal we got to see a uh, zone based on Sky Sanctuary which was nice for you know old school classic Sonic fans like myself. The music was really nice actually. The, uh, the open world has a ambient sort of soundtrack to it but then you get into the classic level and you have a more traditional sort of like high tempo sonic soundtrack um, which really helps because that classic level was actually more like a time trial the controls were tight with um, sonic responding very well to my inputs which i was a bit worried about going into but i'm pleased to say that he was uh, very easy to control i didn't ping him off into the abyss like i was worried i might have done we got to fight a couple of bosses in the in the demo the bosses in particular were quite tricky so basically we had an enemy that we would be able to lock onto in a one-on-one -on -one battle, they would actually unleash combos where we had to either stay back or we had to dodge their, their attacks. Thankfully, there's things like a parry button that you can actually hold and it's not related to timing, which means that you know it enables you to stay in the action a bit more. We could hold on to the parry buttons um, and Sonic would automatically parry those attacks for us. And the combat itself actually felt quite crunchy. The camera swoops in as you're doing your attacks and enables you to like really see like Sonic pounding on these enemies, which was good fun. Overall, first impressions of Sonic uh, are really, really positive. Music was fantastic. We liked, the, we liked just seeing Sonic in an open world, a slightly different environment to what we're used to seeing him in. And also there was still something for us retro fans as well. So being able to see a zone based on Sky Sanctuary with the Death Egg, it's speaking out to me as a modern and a, new, and a classic Sonic fan. So um, all in all, basically a very positive first showing for Sonic here in the UK. And those are our initial thoughts on Sonic Frontiers here at EGX in London. Stay tuned to JHT for more gaming content coming your way soon.